Hi, this is Priscilla from New York. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am here with the one and only global professor, <gasps> Shiborno Isaac Berry. How are you doing today? Good, thanks. Good, awesome. So today, we are going to be holding a challenge, basically. Shibornia is it about me, math or physics? It's about math. This is easy peasy. I, then I got this in the bag. I, 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 I'm <laughs> we'll see. great at math. We'll see. So... Um, for the audience, what I'm going to be doing is first I'm going to be giving Shiborno two digit numbers to square. Wait, so I have a calculator, right? No, the calculator is in here. <laughs> we'll see how you do. And after that, I'm going to give you random two three digit numbers to add together. And is you that have to give me the sum? Is that 23 digit numbers or two digit two, numbers or three digit numbers? Three digit numbers. Anyway. That you have to add together. <laughs> okay, are you ready for the first part? Yes. Squaring two digit numbers. Can you square 25 for me? No, don't look at that. 625. That is correct. Nice. Can you square 65 for me? All right, so uh, now you take 60 times 60. Don't worry, be patient. 60 times 60 is um, 3,600. So 60 times 65 would be 60 times 60 plus 60 times 5. 60 times 5 would be 300. So 60 times 65 would be 3,900. And then 65 times 61 is, wait, um, 3,965. 65 times 62 is... uh. 40 30 uh 65 times 63 is 40 95 65 times 64 is uh 40 150 and 65 times 65 uh should be 42 15 close it's 42 25 but that was very cool to kind of Listen to your thought process. <laughs> I'll give you another one. Yeah. Can you square 42? The answer to everything. Okay. Uh, 40 <laughs> times 40. So 40 times 40 should be 1600. So 40 times 42 should be 1680. And then 41 times 42 should be 1720. 42 times 42 should be 1760. Is that your final answer? No, 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 no. <laughs> I meant, I meant, I meant. Sorry, sorry. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm going crazy. <laughs> anyway, so you get forty. So, uh, sixteen hundred, then sixteen eighty, then sixteen eighty plus forty two. So sixteen eighty plus eighty four. Sixteen eighty. Uh, so seventeen hundred plus sixty four. Seventeen sixty four. That is correct. <laughs> Ooh. Knew my method would work out. <laughs> we have two more numbers for you to square. Can you square 53? Okay. So 50 times 50 is 2,500. 53 times 50. Uh, 2,650. Uh, and two, 2,650. Uh, Plus fifty three is uh twenty seven oh three fifty two times fifty three is uh twenty seven fifty six and sixty three times sixty three is twenty seven fifty six plus fifty three and twenty seven fifty six plus fifty is twenty eight oh six twenty eight oh six Plus three is twenty eight oh nine. It's fifty three times fifty three. That is correct. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> baby. Okay, one more number for you to square. Forty eight. Hmm. All right. So fifty times fifty is uh twenty five hundred. Then we can decrease actually. So forty eight times fifty is going to be twenty five. Twenty five hundred minus. 100, so that's 2,400, and then 48 times 49 is going to be, uh, we have 2,400 minus 48, right, I, um, so 2,400 minus 48, so 2,400, uh, 20, 
2352 is 49 times 48, and then 2352 minus 48 is 2304, which would be 48 times 48. That is correct. <laughs> that is very, very cool. I'm not going to lie. Thank you guys once again for watching today's video, and we hope to see you in another one very, very soon. Bye! Bye. Guys.